Elan X5 turning signal array light here. It's a streamlined design here. It's designed based on some spoke cards. You can see it here. It's controlled by a remote controller here. And let's turn it on by long pressing the button on the right side here. It has 80 lumens brightness, so you can see from 100 meters away. Now let's see the function here. There are four buttons here, and the middle of the button can change the flash modes. It has three flash modes here. You press. Press. Again. Again, we can see the laser light function here. Press the top button here. It has two flash modes. You can create a safety zone to guarantee your safety when you're riding at night. And if you don't want to use it, you can turn it off. Okay, let's see the most important function. Turn signal. Okay, let's see. Turn left. And turn right. And it also has a light sensor here at the bottom of the light. When you're riding in the daytime, it will go off automatically. Okay, let's see what comes with it. A piece of foam. Some plastic parts and two screws and nuts. The light, a rubber band, a remote controller, and a mount with a belt. And of course you need a screwdriver here. So you let me show you how to install the remote controller here. Hook one side of the rubber band here and then wind the handlebar. Hook on the side here. Okay, it's stable and it's easy. And let's come back to the line itself. It has two ways of installation. One is install under the under the saddle, and the other is install on the pipe. So let's show you the first method. Install on the pipe. You need to use one piece of the foam here and peel up the sticky side and uh, wind around the pipe here. When you start, it's like this. You can cut, cut off the spare parts or you can keep it here, like this. Anyway, it's for more friction. And uh, let's see the mold here. Wind around the foam and put it through the mold. And pull it. As tight as possible. Okay. Then put the light here. That's it. And you can adjust the angle. Slightly press the button here and take it off this way and actually if you install like this way you don't need to take it off all the time so you can just keep it here under the saddle there's some there's two pipes here first you should put the screw and nuts like this because if you install like this, it's not supposed to be removable, so you should put the light in advance like this. And then put it here and use the other part of the plastic and put it inside. 
make it fit for the pipe. And then use the screwdriver to make it tight. And let's see. That's it. Okay, so that's the end of the day. Thank you.